If you're a Fort Wayne utility customer, your rates are about to double. With a unanimous decision, the City Council voted to raise Fort Wayne's sewage rates tonight. The average City Utilities customer pays about $19 a month right now, and with the rate hike, customers would pay about $35. News Channel 15's Aisha Husney joins us now with more. That rate increase has a lot to do with Fort Wayne's rivers. You wouldn't know it, but billions of gallons of sludge and sewage goes into our rivers every single year. And every single year, that gunk spills out about 70 times. To stop that from happening, Fort Wayne wants to fix storm sewers and expand the wastewater treatment plant. But it all comes at a big price, a price that has caused a heated debate at the city council meeting tonight. There's a choice they have to make to pay the bill or to eat. It's a choice many may have to make soon. A federal mandate requires cities across the U.S. to clean their water. I see a huge economic bonus to the city of Fort Wayne. But cleaning up decades of sludge and raw sewage requires a good amount of cash. That's where the five-year sewage rate increase comes in. The extra money would eliminate 90 percent of this sludge. But it's money Donna Schaefer doesn't want to shell out. I don't care if bicyclists have to hold their nose while they are riding down the River Greenway. Schaefer runs a business that pays an average $60 a month for sewage. Once I figure out what those costs are going to be, I'm going to have to raise our prices a little bit. I don't know that I'm going to be able to raise enough to cover it all. And if her prices get too high, Schaefer thinks her customers won't come back. But others think the price of not doing something will end up costing much more. Five dollars to me is very important, but at the same time, saving somebody five thousand to ten thousand dollars is more important. Now, here's a little bit of good news: the total rate hike will not happen all at once. It will go up gradually until 2013. But you'll see the first difference on your July bill. Aisha Hassani, News Channel 15. Also.